Hi, I'm Graham Mossman from Intelligent Edge Group and today I'm going to show you how to download a sample database I've put together to demonstrate the features of the Exasol database. Microsoft have the Northwind database, Oracle have the HR database, but I prefer to use real-life meaningful data which I've extracted from the online CIA World Factbook which gives some interesting statistics about the countries of the world. I first need to download the scripts and CSV data files I need from my Git repository. This is how you do it in Linux. If you're a Windows user, you'll need to install a Git client. Once I've acquired the latest copy of my Git repository, I go to Exa Plus and create a new schema called Demo. Then I load the SQL script I previously downloaded. This script is intended to be run in the ExaPlus GUI and contains two variables, my schema, which will be demo in this case, and my data directory, which is the directory you use to download my Git repository. I run it and put in the schema name and the location of the CSV data files. The tables will be created and the data will be imported into those tables from the CSV files. Now that we have the sample data loaded, we can try out some of Exasol's SQL language features and have a look at this rather excellent ExaPlus GUI. Here's a query which returns the GDP of a country, basically a measure of how rich it is, and the number of airports in that country. You might imagine that there's a link between how rich a country is and how many airports it has. Well, here you can prove just how strong that correlation is with this Exasolve function. And here's another query which looks at the number of TV channels in a country compared to its population. If you ignore the countries with no TV channels or an unknown number of them, the least well-served country in the world is Ethiopia, which has only one TV channel for nearly 94 million people. At the other end of the scale we have the Vatican City, which has one TV channel in a country of less than a thousand people. The other standout statistic for me is this mind-boggling number of channels in Russia. And that's the end of this short exploration of my sample database for Exasol. Thanks for your time and I'll see you again soon.